out of Jakarta. It was a great time while it lasted, yeah. <laughs> Thank you for having me, Jakarta, Aww. yeah. Ooh. Yes. <laughs> Pink Ninja. Very interesting toilet. So we finally made it to the airport, ran into a bunch of Pink's fans. Shout out to the Pink Gang. They always show us so much love and these girls were the sweetest. We also ran into our new friend, Bia Badubi. If you don't know who she is, get into her because she is that girl and her music is fire. And this is the day in the life of a tour wifey. Malaysia edition, baby. Okay, so boom, let's get into the hotel, y'all. We pulled up to Sunway Resort and felt like we were the king and queen because the ambiance, the essence, everything very much gives royal. Like, look at the aesthetics. It was so beautiful. If you ever go to Malaysia, you definitely want to stay here because they treat you right. And it's just the architecture is to die for. The video is not even doing it justice. Like, when you walk in, you're really like, wow. <laughs> But you know what time it is. Let's get into the room tour. Get into it. Chic, sleek, aesthetics on 10. I need this bed. I need this marble desk, <laughs> okay? And outside the window, we can actually see where Pink's gonna be performing tonight. So that was pretty cool. But you know my baby, he had to get his little nap in. So he already in the what? The bed. But let's get into the bathroom because the bathroom was my favorite part of this hotel suite. Stunning. Do we see this marble? Do we see this counter? Do we see this Balmain soap and lotion? Like, they just giving out Balmain for the free? Crazy. This is Bunga. She is an amazing rapper, artist in Malaysia. Fire, go check her out. I brought Pink up to the suite because we had a little surprise plan for him. Little did he know. This is for you. So they presented him with a seven times platinum plaque, baby. Not one, not two, not the three, but seven, the number of completion, okay? My man did that and I'm so proud of him. All right, so let's get into a little get ready with me real quick. So I had to wash my face, do my like 60 step skincare moisturize routine, put on my sunblock because I'm not playing with y'all, getting rid of these acne scars. Do on a quick beat, which means eyebrows, concealer, and go. Blend it out, pat her down, do a quick little bake. Make sure I don't look too tired because your girl was tired. Throw on my lily lashes and then wake up my man. <laughs> you gotta wake up. Come on. Rise and shine, sleepyhead. Run on no sleep. Day two. <laughs> Malaysia needs you in 10 minutes. It's showtime, baby. So I had to get my man together, get him lotion down, give him the king treatment that he deserves because he was so tired. He's been working so hard, running on very little sleep. So can't have him out there ashy on stage, lotion that man. Damn. Do my wifey duties and get him together, baby. Fit check. All right, you already know what it is. We got on a little silk set. Somebody actually gave that the pink, but I made it work for me. A little most chino bralette, you know. Get into the Chanel bag and get into the couple look. Aww. Look at pink and bunny, the lovebirds. And we're on our way to the show. Can't wait to see my man perform. All right, we are on our way to the festival. Pink is very tired, but he's pushing through. He's not feeling too good. But what you say about when you have the sniffles? You sound even better. 
<laughs> Big Dave. Look at this. Big Josh. Thank you. Whoa. <laughs> Hi. 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 Oh, do I have a mask? I don't think you need a mask. No. Masks are optional. <laughs> can't zoom in. Oh, you can't zoom in for a cam. On our way. Thing about Pink is he gonna get his nap in, okay? He not playing with y'all when it comes to his Z's. But we pulled up to the venue, which was beautiful, stunning, like something out of a movie. Went straight into interviews with a bunch of different blogs, podcasts, fans, news stations. Everybody pulled up on my man. And he had to sign some autographs for some posters right before we grabbed some food from Kraft. Pink went on stage, Bia Badubi was on the second stage, and she killed it with her band. Love her, love her, love her. The bear is lower! The crowd was fire in Malaysia. When I tell you, when you look out into the crowd, you can't see where it ends. Like it was just a sea of people going crazy, going ham for Pink and singing every lyric. It was beautiful. This was one of my favorite moments of the show because there was two stages connected and Pink literally was running from one side to the other side. The fans were going crazy. The energy in the, I was about to say room, but we weren't even in the room. We were outside and outside was lit. I put you first, hey! And for you, girl, I swear I'll do the Everybody sing it off, hey, hey! Ooh. After the gang crushed the show, me and Pink went and grabbed some McDonald's real quick. While we were at McDonald's, the manager called us and was like, yo, you have all these fans waiting outside your hotel waiting for you to come back. So what we do, we ran back to the hotel so we could say what's up. All of the fans were mad sweet, super supportive, asking for pictures. They were even congratulating me on getting married and asking me for pictures. I was just like, y'all are so nice. I don't know why y'all so nice to us, but this is the best part seeing pink in his element seeing him showing love and seeing how his music imp impacts everybody from across the freaking world is crazy <laughs> So we got that McDonald's. At this point, McDonald's needs to run me my money for a campaign, okay? 
but it gave Mickey D's and hit the sheets. Ow. <laughs>